Hey guys, what is going on? Randy Moop here and welcome back to another video. Today guys, I'm going to be showing you on how to make your voice sound more professional and much better in Sony Vegas when it comes to doing videos or making um, commentaries over or pretty much anything to do with your audio when it comes to um, producing voice clips in Sony Vegas. So what you're going to want to do guys is you're going to add in free, free effects to your voice clips. Okay, so here I'm gonna I'm gonna go through the effects in a moment. This is just what I have so far. Hey guys, this is just a test without any of the filters. That's no filters. Hey guys, this is a test with just one of the filters. That's just one of them, guys. Hey guys, this is a test with two of the filters. As you can hear, it's getting much better and more, you know, more does test with all three of the filters added to this voice clip. And as you can hear in the last one, compare to this one right here. Hey guys, this is just a test without any of the filters. Guys, this is a test with all three of the filters and as you can hear guys, it's a lot more bassy, more soft and a lot more higher without turning up your volume so that it's, you know, that you can't even hear. Because for example, if I turn that all up, Hey guys, this is a test with all three of the filters and you can't hear if I just turn Hey it guys, this is a test with all three of you can hear what I'm saying, but it's it's also louder than what this one is. Because this one I'd have to turn up. Hey guys, this is just a test about any of the filters. Okay, so it's much better. So these are the filters, guys. So when you add in your voice clip like I have here, okay, you're going to click this little button here. Now this little button right there, guys, you can also, if you go into your menu here, it's also there. But I just use this one. They're both the same and they both take you to this page here. Now, guys, if you scroll over, if I make this bigger right here, okay, see that we have all these filters. But we're not going to play with all these filters. We're just going to play with this one here, which is track compressor, track EQ, and track noise gate. Now, what they do, guys, this one, if we add this one, the noise gate, this one will just that the microphone is picking up. So if I just go to YouTube, which is my settings already, as you can see, guys, this little lever here, these two are, you're just going to leave the same. So if I just go do that one, it's just the same, okay? Now, when you move this one, you're going to put it on 35, okay? So if I take away that, oh, I've deleted it now. Um, <laughs> You're going to just going to go and find around 35, 36, something like that, so that my microphone do not let it go any higher than what I'm telling it to go to. Okay, so I'm just going to add that one in okay and then to save them guys you're just gonna go type in at the top here just type in like youtube or whatever you need them for guys and click save right there okay so we have that one saved for us okay you're gonna close that down then you're gonna go back into it you're gonna click this little button here plug in chain and then you're gonna find track eq and then click add then click OK and it'll take you to this one. And then this one, guys, is a little bit confusing because if you do these high, too high, then it's going to pretty much ruin your track. Uh, this is for your like bass and stuff like that. So if I just go to YouTube here, you can see my settings. So number one, this one right here, guys. Uh, the frequency is on 100. Then it's free and then it's 12. I don't mess with the bottom one, the roll off, but the gain is free, guys, and the frequency is 100. Um, two and three are just left as they are then four here guys i've got five thousand six and twelve okay so that one's pretty easy just make sure you do that you can play around with these as well guys as you say no number is a magic number everything everyone's microphone and everyone's um you know voice is different so that's my that's my settings anyway um then you go to track compressor now this is the one that makes your voice sound a lot smoother but also high pit um higher as well so that you're not you know you're not completely flat so if i just go to my settings youtube here okay so this what don't mess with these ones don't mess with input gain and output gain this this one here okay so what is it trash shot whatever that says you're just going to make that to minus 21.5 then the amount is free then these two will stay the same as 15 and 250 Okay, then make sure you click smooth saturation. If you do not click that, guys, then your voice isn't going to sound smooth. Okay, so once you've clicked all them, your voice will sound like this. Hey, guys, this is just a test about any of the filters instead of this. Hey, guys, this is a test with just one of the filters. If you can hear the difference, guys. Hey, guys, this, hey guys, this is just a test about any of the test with just one of the test about any of the filters. Just one of as you can see guys it's totally different and it sounds so much better so yeah guys that's pretty much you know how to uh, do your voice voices in here 
so yeah guys i hope you like this little video it's not much i just needed to show you guys how to do it i recently found out how to do this guys and i thought i'd share it with you guys because you know there's not that many good videos on how to do it um and i thought i'd make my own and show you guys how to do it so yeah i hope you like guys uh hit that like button if you can guys and please can you help me get to 300 subscribers